Hey yo, what's poppin'? Party people, I'm that one dude, Christian Yusuf, and welcome to a difficult game about climbing. Are any of you familiar with the game Getting Over It with Bennett Foddy? Or, or, if maybe you're not from that era of YouTube, are you familiar with Only Up? These are two games that I got the idea of, that I got the vibes from when I saw this game. I was like, this is definitely gonna be one of those getting over it style games. I don't think this is as, ah, uh, I don't think this is as uh, unforgiving as Only Up because, oh my God. Because Only Up didn't have any save states, fuck. So the controls are super simple, I suppose. You just move your mouse up, and then you use the left and right mouse button to grab, which is gonna get really tedious because I have to keep moving my mouse down my mouse pad so that I can, this is actually not that bad. Hold on. I might be able to make, fuck, I might be able to make some genuine. Okay, I need to remember which hand is which. Oh. Oh no, this is wet. Oh no. Oh, that's gonna be a challenge. Okay, all right, all right, genuinely, this is not that bad. If you just focus and take your time you can get it. Oh, it's gonna strain the fuck out of my hand, though. Get no! Okay. <laughs> okay. Not that bad. Not that bad. I just gotta take my time. Take your time, Chris. Oh, that's gonna break, isn't it? Fuck, why did I do that? I don't see this getting as ragey. You can do it, tiny man. You have the upper body strength of Hercules. Because there's absolutely no reason why a normal human being should be able to do something like this. You're on a grand journey to prove your worth. And you know what? It's achievable. This is an achievable goal. Uh, what am I supposed to do here? Oh, oh, I got it. 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 No! I haven't even made it that far. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I can just turn myself into a little robo. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I was like, how am I supposed to get over to the cliff again? This is how I turn myself into a propeller. A propeller rowboat. Alright, Chris, lock in. Focus. Focus. Your career is on the line here. If I can achieve this, I can achieve anything in gaming history. You know what? That'd be a damn good feat. Okay. Alright. Okay. Okay. No, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. Okay, I got that, I got that, I got that, I got that, I got that. <gasps> oh, take it easy. Take it easy, tiny man. Take it easy, tiny man. There's nowhere for me to hang! What do you want me to do? Where am I going? Okay, 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 wait, 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 chill, chill, chill out! There we go, there we go, that's all you needed to do. That's all you needed to do. You're good. You're good. You're good. Oh, 
Oh, how do I get up there? Ah. No. Okay. All right, chill. No! <laughs> Calm down. It's not that serious. What do you want me to do there? Ah, heave! Heave! It's like I can get a little bit of grip. Why is my hand in the air? It's like I can... I can get a little bit of grip while I'm on the grippy part. Oh my god. I'm gonna get burns on my wrist from doing this. Okay. Alright. Okay. Chill. Ugh. <sighs> How are you guys doing? As of today recording this video, it is Easter. Um, and I just want to say happy Easter to you guys, even though this video probably most definitely will not be up by Easter. <laughs> but um, I hope you guys are having a great time. I hope you're enjoying yourselves with your families. And uh, I hope you're enjoying this video. I don't know. No, it's not even like I can like It's not even like I can quickly, like, scurry my way up, because it's just gonna- I just slip immediately. Whoa! Whoa. I'm not making it past, like... This is probably the easy part, too. Several people have probably made it farther than this in, like, the first 15 minutes. Probably the first 10. First 5, honestly. Is there, like, a... Oh, okay, well, the controls are here. W and space are to pull up. Pull up can help reduce arm fatigue, but is necessary to play. Huh? Huh? <laughs> Rage quit. Huh? Oh, so I can use space instead of... Oh. That's a lot easier. That's gonna kind of fuck me up, though. Oh. 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 Oh, you're so close. You're almost there! No! You're almost there, God! Oh no. What do you mean? Oh, ah. oh okay. Alright, we're in the clear there. Ah. I won't falter! I will progress! This is my lifelong dream. To climb a mountain. I will make it. I will do it. I can succeed. I will. I must. And nobody's gonna stop me! Nobody! Nobody can stop me! Okay. Alright. Alright. This is good. This is good. This is a good position that I'm in right now. This is a really good position that I'm in. Oh my god. What do you mean down? What? No. 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 I'm gonna- I'm gonna take the easy way down. <laughs> I don't want to play anymore. I don't like this game. What you mean, death? What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? No, no, no. Oh, not this part again. Oh, my fuck. <gasps> uh. Wait. This is a speedrunner strat. This is a speedrunner strat. If I can just... Uh, 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 uh. No, it's not. I'm not. I can't do that. No, I should never say that I can't. I won't. <laughs> Get it. Oh. You know what else I'm really excited for? I'm excited for uh, Baby Steps. That's also another game that's actually made by Bennett Foddy, along with another studio, I think. And, uh, it looks like it's gonna revolve around... 
I think the story is that you're some lazy guy who is out of something and you like have to get up and learn how to walk again. I don't I don't know, but it's it looks really fun. Ugh. Ugh. Okay, all right, we're slipping, we're slipping, we're slipping, we're slipping. Ah! We're doing good. This is a okay. I don't know what to say. Oh fuck, fuck, fuck! I forgot. I gotta go down. Oh, it's slippery. It's slippery. The bone structure is not a good, not a good bone structure. What do I do? Where do I go? Do I actually have to make this jump? Oh my goodness. No, please, no! I don't know what to do there! So what do I do? What am I supposed to do there? I know they don't want me to make that jump. I also have so many questions about why this man is naked why we are on this journey in the first place. See, my guess is, right, there's dinosaur bones, okay? My guess is that we are in the prehistoric era. And, okay, hold on. Instead of being at, being at a low point, what if I try to make the jump from a high point? No! I just started the game. I just started the game. I just started the video. I've only been recording for 26 minutes and I'm already getting pissed. Okay. All right. Okay. Uh, all seriousness aside, <laughs> like he's in a prehistoric era, right? So maybe this is the first human to ever try mountain climbing. Maybe he, oh fuck, I, don't, I really don't care anymore. <laughs> if and when I ever beat this game, I, I want to see some speedrunner strats of this, because, holy hell, I usually don't care about speedrunners, or not to say, not to say that I do not care about speedrunners themselves, but I don't care about speedruns, um, it's impressive to see how quickly somebody can get a game done, but, for this game, oh my god, I gotta see how people do it. Because you know there's going to be speedrunners. They give you a best time in everything. This game also requires a lot of focus, too. Because it's like, when my hands get mixed up like this, I have to remember, like, which finger is on which button. So, like, it looks like my left is... I don't know why I'm pointing at my computer screen. It looks like my left is my right hand. So if I get that mixed up, I could accidentally let go of the left when I'm not trying to. And that takes a lot of skill, a lot of focus, and a lot of determination. No, 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 you're gonna slip, you're gonna slip unless you grab on. Alright, so what happens if, okay, I just gotta get myself some good momentum. I fucking had it. I fucking had it. I've had it. I've had it. I I had it and I've had it. Oh boy, I'm gonna go insane. I'm gonna go crazy. So does that skull and bones mean that I shouldn't go there, or does that mean that you know there's a chance that I could lose my progress? Is it just telling me, hey, you might fuck up here, or is it like, hey? Don't go over here. Because if that's the case... Because if that's the case, I don't see where else I'm supposed to go. If that's the case, I have made it to the top of the cliff because there's nowhere else for me to go. <laughs> oh. 
you really have to watch your fucking momentum. Oh my goodness. Because if you if you grab onto something and then you kind of just swing, you're gonna he's gonna let go. He's gonna let go. It's one of those don't let go until you're absolutely sure this is what you want to do kind of thing. Like that. Like that. Like that. That was an that was a perfect example of what I meant. By don't let go until you are absolutely sure that this is what you want to do. On the bright side, I'm getting a lot faster with this beginning part. Why am I suddenly struggling to grab this gas tank? Why am I suddenly struggling? Oh, the fatigue is real. Fatigue is real. I haven't even been doing this for that long. Okay, so let me assess the situation here. Once I get over there, what do I do? I, I obviously have to go down. How far away should I be? before I start making the jump. Please, no! All I gotta say right now is rest in peace to bro's hands. He has been climbing, he has been slipping and sliding. His hands are not making it. He's gonna need like immediate surgery. If I ever make it up this mountain, homie's gonna need immediate surgery. I can I can just barely reach it. I can just barely reach it. But I'm scared. I'm I, I'm scared cuz if I reach and I grab and oh no you oh. Oh. <sighs> to everyone who finds this entertaining. I just want to let you know. <laughs> there may be no more videos from this channel. Because I'm going to raid so fucking hard. That my camera, my mic, my, my monitor, my PC. Obliterated. I'm going to turn everything to ash. My God. I'm going to get arthritis, carpal tunnel. I'm gonna get all the all the bad hand. This is my good hand too. I write with this hand. My right hand is my dominant hand. And the fact that I use it as my mouse, obviously. I don't know anybody who uses their non-dominant hand as their mouse. Or for anything for that matter. But I just I'm straining my hand playing this game. And all for your guys' entertainment too. Let that sink in. Let that sink in. A man, a, a man of society is straining his hand for your entertainment. <laughs> for your entertainment. So if I can no longer write, if I can no longer, like let's say, let's say in the future, right? I, I start showing up to conventions. Uh-huh. And you guys want to meet me. Because I would love to meet you guys. Every, every single one of you seems so chill. 
But what if? But what if I can no longer sign autographs because I played this game for you? Okay, the goal sometimes is to just reach. Just reach, but don't shoot for the moon. You can reach for the moon, but don't shoot for it just yet. Right? Reach for it, but don't shoot. Reach, don't shoot. Reach, shoot. Reach, shoot. Because you got to be able to aim yourself and let the world know this is where I want to go. This is what I want to do. That's not what I wanted to do. That's not it. That wasn't it. Mm. I can't even make it back to where I wanted. I can't even make it back to the hard part. Like fatigue is real. If you're looking at this and thinking he hasn't even gotten that far, you try it. Try it for yourself. I don't want to hear anybody talking shit until they themselves have tried playing this game. Because it's not easy. I mean, after watching somebody, you know, oh, fuck. After watching somebody and getting a feel for how the game works and getting an idea of what you're supposed to do. Yeah, sure. Maybe you can look at it and be like, oh, I can make it to like where he's struggling. But then after that, after that, what are you going to do? What are you going to do? Your hand can only take so much movement, so much work. The human hands were not made for games like this. Doctors hate this game. Or doctors, doctors love this game, as a matter of fact. Because the more you play, the higher your fucking medical bill is going to shoot up. Because you're going to have to go see a doctor every week about... Your crippled hands, your crippled fingers, and they're gonna ask you, "Well, how'd your fingers get like this?" I played a game called a difficult game about crime, and the doctor's gonna go, "Oh boy, I've heard of that game. You know how many other patients I've had in the last seven days who have come in here about the same issue?" And I'll go, "Oh my God, that's so funny. Do they also have YouTube channels?" <laughs> and then maybe, just fucking maybe. I could start networking. Maybe I could start making some content creator friends. Maybe, maybe we can all bond over the fact that we ruined our fingers to play a game about a naked man climbing a mountain. <laughs>
See? What are you what are you supposed to do? Where do you go from there? Where do you go? I don't know. I really don't know. That was good though. Like that was a good swing. I think if I use both arms. Oh my god, I don't I don't know anymore. And don't get me wrong, like I know that I can stop at any time. I know that I can stop playing at any time. But there's something, there's a fire in me. There's a deter there's a, a level of determination that forces me to keep going. I'm filled with determination. But that determination is slowly turning into frustration. And then that frustration will slowly turn into rage. And the rage is going to then turn into destruction. And the destruction is going to be the end of me. I'm going to get canceled because I'm going to rage so hard. that I'm going to do things that I shouldn't do. I know better than to say things that I shouldn't say. But there's a level of things that you shouldn't do on camera. <laughs> Oh my god. Well, hi there. Future Chris here. Uh, don't worry. He'll be right back. Just had to take a little breaky break. You know how it is. <laughs> I'm just here to check in and see how you're enjoying the video. I wanted to also apologize for the lack of progress. I'm sure a lot of others have made it significantly farther than this, but you know me. I'm sure he'll make decent progress eventually. Oh, oh, I think I hear him coming back. <laughs> bye bye now. I needed to grab some water because the way that I'm heating myself up with this level of frustration And I don't I don't want to look it up either I don't I really don't want to have to look up like what you're supposed to do because then I'm gonna feel really stupid it's gonna be something super obvious like there's just another one above me and I just I haven't seen it yet I I don't know <laughs> I really don't know all I know is that I'm getting like genuinely frustrated with the fact that I cannot seem to figure this out this is like a puzzle in a video game that you've been trying to figure out for hours or like a location in an RPG game that you've been trying to find because the story doesn't tell you where exactly you're supposed to go. But then you talk to that one NPC or you do that one thing. Just get over there. Get the fuck over there. And then it's like, oh, that was obvious. I could have figured that out on my own. But you didn't. And that's how I, I don't want to have to feel that way. I don't want to have to look it up and be like, oh, that was stupid of me. Why didn't I think of that? Because I hate doing that in video games. There's a sense of accomplishment that you get when you figure something out on your own. When you overcome a challenge without the use of help. That's why when I was younger, I... I don't even know where I'm going with the story anymore. When I was younger, I had a lot of like video game guides for the games that I used to play. Specifically Zelda games and Pokemon games. And looking back at it now, it's like those games are really difficult for a kid. So it's understandable as to why I needed them. But as an adult, I have a higher level of intelligence. I have a higher level of understanding of how video games work and, you know, what the mechanics are for said game. I don't get stuck as often playing a Zelda game or playing a Pokemon game, especially Pokemon. Because... If you know anything about Pokemon, they sure as hell don't make it difficult anymore. But my point being, I don't want to have to look up anything about like, oh, you know, where am I supposed to go? Because this arrow could say, go down, but it could just be a trick. I, it could just be tricking me. I don't think it is, 
But where else do I go? Because, okay, let's take this for example, right? If I go down here, then this just leads back down to the start. I don't want to do that. I don't want to go there. That's not where I need to go. But then unless there's something at the top here that I just can't reach for, and then that's where I just came from. I don't know why I keep pointing like you guys can see where I'm pointing at. It's got to be here. This has to be where I need to go. And this it's not working. It's not working. It's not working. It's not. That's that doesn't work. That I I think I'm more so frustrated at the fact that I just genuinely don't know where I need to go. I'm not even frustrated at the fact that I keep on messing up. I think it's because I don't know where I'm supposed to go. I'm trying all these different options, but none of them seem to be leading me to what I need to actually do. Because, yeah, losing my progress sucks, but it's really not that hard. If I focus at this point, especially at this point, it's not that hard to get back to where I need to be. It's trying to figure out what next. That's really my challenge. Okay, so here's my thought process. Okay. The cliff that I just jumped off of is higher than the one that I'm currently on now. So the idea would naturally be to be as high as you can when you flip. The problem with that is there is not much grip area down below that allows me to do that and be successful, right? This, this little section right here is all I've got to grab on. If I don't make it, if he doesn't grab on while I'm in this general area, there's nothing I can do. I just don't think I understand what the game wants from me. Because even from here, you think if you get enough momentum, you can definitely grab onto that. But I think the safest bet would be to, like, be at the tippity top. And I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> I'm done. I'm done because it doesn't make any sense. It's no longer making sense as to how it's not doing what I needed to do. How I'm losing so much moment. How I'm just dipping like that. Instead of... I'm done. Hi. I'm back. I don't know if this is going to be in another video or if this is going to be in the same video. I have no clue, but I did a little bit off screen because I was just like, maybe if I can get a method down, I'll be able to do it a bit better in the next video. I made it, of course. I made it across somehow. And now I am at a sign that says peak. I don't know if this is true or if they're just fucking with me, but I did not want to finish the game without having you guys with me so we're gonna we, we might finish this i don't know they might just be fucking with me come on grab it i can smell it we're almost there the peak is in my sights they might be lying i i think they're lying i don't think we're at the peak at all I'm just happy that I'm no longer at that stupid part. Can I go down here? Oh, I can't because it's water. Okay. All right. Okay. There's no way that this could get taken away from me, right? Okay, okay, this is not bad. This is not bad at all. But I know that if I close out of the game, I'm not gonna be able to make it back here. Okay, okay, okay. Oh no. Oh no, that's a death spot. Oh, I could lose it all, can I? I could easily lose this all.
I could easily lose this all. Oh my goodness. Okay. Okay. We are clearly not at the peak. Um, I, do, I don't want to keep playing. So I'm going to have to add this into the next video. I know. I know. I know. I know. I teased you all for no reason. I just... I can't keep going. We're clearly not at the peak. We're not even close. The game lied to me. It got my hopes up. So, outro clip now. If you wanted to see my last video, which was Supermarket Simulator, it'll be linked somewhere around here. If you want to see me play only up, if you want to see me rage a little less, <coughs> because that game didn't really make me rage. I, I fucked up a lot, and it hurt. It was sad, but I, I wasn't smashing my mouse. Shut the fuck up! I wasn't smashing my mouth on the desk. I wasn't... Oh, I'm getting warm. I'm actually sweating. That'll be linked somewhere around here as well. Uh, I'm gonna get out of here. I love you guys. Stay safe out there. I'm gonna need a break from this game, so please don't ask for it anytime soon. Big buddy out. I I'm done. <laughs>